Hey guys, down here. Uh, I want to throw in a quick video. Um, got an easy mouse trap that I've been using. Uh, using it in my garage. I don't have that bad of a mouse problem, but every now and then there'll be evidence that there's a mouse in the garage trying to get into my feed bin because the bags I had stored, you can see some droppings in it. The the empty bags that is. So let me show you a real quick tape bit on how I trap my mice. Uh, I used to use this plastic folders can. Well, I'm sure everybody can get one. Uh, just cut a little hole here. Not too big, just big enough where the mouse can get inside. Uh, if you want to measure a mine, it's about two inches, two inches in diameter. And what I did is I stuck one of these old sticky uh, mouse pad thingies. I put some peanuts and my dog's pieces of my dog's dog food in there because. I know I said I'd like to eat that too when I had that out in the garage. That's where I store my feed and dog food. But anyhow, the reason I put the plastic trap in here in the can is because before I just used the plastic or the sticky trap, put it in the cupboard out there in the garage and come up missing. So apparently that critter got on top and crawled away on two legs or something. I don't know. <laughs> Anyways, my wife is laughing at me. Anyways, so this is how it works. Once he gets stuck on here, he can't escape. And you can just easily just toss it out into a bag and throw it in a trash can or throw the whole can away and make another one, depending on how much cans you can get of these plastic containers. So I'll just dump them out on it and reuse it over and over you know, you know how mice are they like to hide in things and explore so just the easy tidbit I got on trapping mice if you have that problem or just to be secure just to make sure that you don't have any mice you can use this so we'll see how it works out thanks for looking